Imagine a wall of dark, syrupy liquid crashing through brick streets, the air thick with the smell of burnt sugar, trapping people like flies in amber. On January 15, 1919, Boston's North End became a disaster zone when a molasses storage tank ruptured, unleashing a 25-foot high wave moving at 35 miles per hour. Eyewitness Harold J. O'Leary described it as a brown tsunami that rolled down the street, pulling everything into its sticky maw. The disaster was catastrophic. Only one lives lost, a 50 injured, and a hundred million US dollars in damages, equivalent to 1.8 billion US dollars today. But from this sugary nightmare, something changed. Massachusetts passed the Tank Safety Act, mandating hydrostatic testing and annual inspections. The American Society of Mechanical Engineers, Boiler and Pressure Vessel Code, was also born. This tragedy even made its way into pop culture with an episode of The Simpsons spoofing the Great Molasses Flood. The question is, what if the next industrial disaster is just around the corner? Will we learn from history, or will we repeat it? The Great Molasses Flood may have been a disaster, but it forged the steel rules that keep our world safe today. But at what cost, and for how long?